Gaffer, a point apiece this evening. What did you make of that one? It was a tough game. You know, we're delighted with a point in the end. Uh, we had a couple of good chances that we could have gone and won the game for sure. But John Ruddy's also made a fantastic save near the end there as well. So, uh, on the back of uh, two defeats, real tough, tough away games to come and play under the lights at St Andrews today. It was important that we still showed that commitment and that level of enthusiasm. And I thought the lads, you know, worked their socks off tonight. And it was all about the squad. And disappointed not to win the game, but also happy we didn't lose the game. Yeah, absolutely. When you look at the chances in the first half, you had one cleared off the line, a few crucial blocks back there from QPR defenders. We're here talking about that last little bit again. Yeah, absolutely. And it's something that I've said from since I've been here, really, we have to be more better in the final third. You know, that uh, that delivery, that, that finish, you know, someone wanting to be the man, um, someone to make the difference, you know, and that's what we're, we need. We've got to keep working hard on the training field at that, of course, and uh, hopefully that will come. Yeah, and whilst we, we haven't scored tonight, do you take positives in the fact that we now seem to be consistently creating chances in games? You look back over the last three and you can point to any number of, a handful of chances um, in both halves against, against Preston Watford and, and here tonight. Yeah, I am. And, and it's about growing. It's about developing together, you know, doing the right things. And you, we have to remember that this squad of players, uh, a new squad now, really, we've got 15, 16 new players in. You know, we've had injuries to them players. They're coming back now. We're, we're missing players again through injury. So, you know, it's, in, it's, it's tough to get that level of, of uh, consistency, but I think we've shown that that level of consistency is, is still there with players who aren't playing with each other week in, week out, you know. So that commitment's there. There's loads more to come from this group for sure, but I think there's some really good signs. Clean sheet tonight, our first since Bristol City, and that gives you a foundation in games to make sure you're always in them. Yep, defensively we're very solid. They're very, very good on that counter-attack, you can see that the big uh, Armstrong, uh, Sinclair, Sinclair Armstrong going forward, Lyndon Dykes, Elias Chair, Chrissy Willock, you know, these are all good good championship players, so our level of concentration was very good, they had a little spell there for 10-15 minutes, which I thought we saw out, it was really pleasing that we um, we got Dembele back on the pitch and Juki back on the pitch, you know, um, so there's lots of positives to take out of it, you know, and um, I'm pleased with the point in the end. Yeah, and of course, the result maintains our unbeaten start here at St Andrews. How important is it? I know you spoke on this before, but that this is a real fortress, a difficult place for teams to come. Yeah, it is. You can feel the buzz, the, the excitement when you walk, walk from the tunnel onto the pitch. You know, the fans are outstanding tonight, you know, and they really kept behind the group. And we want to make this a really difficult place to come to. And um, unbeaten still here at St Andrews is very important. Yeah, let's talk about John Ruddy. A couple of really big saves. I think there's a double save in there as well. The big one, 10 minutes from time as well. When he was called upon tonight, he came, came up trumps. He was, and that's why John's one of the top goalers in the in the league. You know, he'll be disappointed with a couple of goals he's conceded uh, already this season. But, you know, when, you know, his experience, the way he comes back and that save off Dykes' header was outstanding. Mm -hmm. Lee Buchanan back available today. I mean, what a competitor he is. He very rarely puts a foot wrong back there. No, very good. I thought all back four were, were very good. Cody Drama as well. You know, he's getting better and better the more games he plays, which is great. So, um, yeah, we, we, look, we look good at the back there, you know, and um, we're going to keep improving, keep getting better. So things are looking OK. You've mentioned the fact that you can call upon Lukas Jukovic from the bench tonight. Sariki Dembele back after five weeks as well. There's attacking options there if you need to change it up now. Yeah, really important. You know, really important on that 60, 70 minutes. We're still in the game. You know, there's, especially when it opens up, we've got real good attacking uh, players to come off that bench and make a huge difference. Yeah, when you look at a, a bit of team news, third game in a week, of course, or third game in six days, Ivan Sunjic drops to the bench tonight. Is that just a case of freshening it up? He's putting a lot of miles. He has, yeah. No, he's been outstanding. You know, and I think at home tonight, I think we'd have a lot of the ball. Uh, Bakun has been knocking on the door as well to play in them areas, so it's good good that he went in there and, and did fine. And uh, you know, obviously Scotty coming back in the team as well was was important. You know, it's about freshening the squad. It's about giving the squad um, their chances. And um, uh, and I've said from day one that if we're going to progress and, and improve and get better together, it's, it has to be the squad. It's no individual player. It's not about 11 players. It's about the squad of 22, 23 players. And third game in six days, we needed that squad today. Yeah, absolutely. One negative, Cashy Anderson off before the break. Is there any early indication on how he is? It looks like it's a hamstring injury, which is really disappointing. Obviously, you know, we've asked a lot of Cashy. Obviously, he had a big injuries last season. He's come in, he's been outstanding for us. That third game in six days might have been a little bit too much for him. But, you know, he, when we asked if he felt fit and ready to go he put his hands up and said yeah I can't wait to get going again uh, so obviously we're disappointed that he's come off so hopefully it won't be too bad I'm sure now you're welcome a full week's preparation ahead of Norwich next weekend 
yeah, it'll be good to give the lads a couple of days off now. You know, I think two real tough away trips, but two real positive performance from that. And um, the way they kept going tonight, you know, was really pleasing. So they've earned a couple of days off. We'll be back in Monday now to, to get ready for the Norwich trip. Thanks again, Gaffer. Thank you.